Alyssa wanted to get something to eat because she's under the weather again. I don't know what her deal is. I think I'm dying. You're not dying. Okay, you had, this year you had gotten sick so many times and I remember thinking his immune system is ass and then now it's me. I influenced your immune system, huh? Yeah. I'm your hero. Not really. <laughs> Guess what I'm eating. Wendy's is coming back with their spicy chicken nuggets. Recently, he admitted to me, he was like, you know what, it makes me kind of sad sometimes because like, I be craving fast food. I don't really eat fast food that much unless I really, really need to. Like I used to, I used to eat it a lot. He was like, you know what, it's okay, we'll go to boiling crab for the 50th time. I really don't get sick of boiling crab. It's just, what if I want Taco Bell? What if I want McDonald's? You know, I grew up on these things. You grew up on like your mom's food, right? Sometimes you crave your mother's food. We went out to eat the other day. And we got Taco Bell because yeah, it felt we got, really bad. Because I never really craved Taco Bell like that. But she it was, was fun like, that day. Yeah, now nah, people sleep on Taco Bell. She was the same before I turned the camera on. She was like, I'm so mad at myself. I was like, why? I saw a picture of crab and I'm angry that I have no crab right now. I just realized, I said that I don't really eat fast food, but like in a lot of the videos we film, we're eating fast food, but that's because that's considered that's, like that's the like, emergency. Yeah. We want to film, so we get fast food so we can like have time in the day to film for and That's you only a portion of our day too. It probably seems like we eat fast food a whole lot, but it's literally just when we upload videos or film videos. And like, if you've noticed, we don't upload that much. Not as much <laughs> as we once did. I love you. <laughs> we had nuggets and I would show off her baked potato, but it looks really f***ed up right now This is our second meal of the day. Our first meal of the day was literally the same thing. It was Burger King You're so concentrated. I don't feel good. That's why. I feel really sick You guys know when you can feel yourself about to come down on like the flu and stuff. That's how I feel right now She was sick a while ago. She was like very nauseous for like three days straight And I was on my period so don't and get that, any funky ideas. I was sick that week too. The weather has been up and down recently what happened it tastes so weird it's light sour cream that's why how come everything light tastes so bad uh, like light ranch it's supposed to be less carbs right like it just uh why would they do that? I don't know if we ever, we, we did mention this, that she knows how to cook the boiling crab sauce and she taught me how to yesterday. That's and so good. let me tell you, lobster and the boiling crab sauce is like the best marriage in the world. You did a good job Boy, at cooking it for your first time. At first, because you have to put like tablespoons of different seasoning. But the one thing you don't put a tablespoon of is the cayenne pepper because that dictates the spice level of your sauce. And I thought everything was just the same amount, which means I put too much cayenne pepper. So luckily, I was like, did I do this right? And I bring her over and then she's like, you did this much of Cayenne pepper? I was like, yeah. Because that would have been too spicy. Yeah. I would have still been able to handle it though. One time I went with Daisy to boy to not boiling crab to Buffalo Wild Wings. At that point, I was trying to work my way up to being able to eat the blazing. I wanted to be able to work my way up to where I can eat the blazing, just like you know, like nonchalantly without suffering and stuff. I don't know why. I was just I always wanted to challenge myself. Like I loved spicy stuff at the time. And I remember I got the one below the blazing, so I got the wild one. I think that's what it was called. And I was just dying, and she was like, she was eating her honey barbecue like. And she was like, are you okay? And I was like, yeah. And she was like, why don't you just stop eating? Like, you can have some of mine. And I was like, no, like, I want to keep eating it. I don't know why. I just loved suffering for some reason. I don't know anybody that loves spicy food as much as you do. Bad. It's very bad for you to eat it as constantly as you do. Well, no, I don't eat it as You don't eat it as much, as but that's just because I told you to. You didn't tell me. You said it, and I listened to your suggestion. You're crazy. Oh, uh... At the time that this is being filmed, we have caught up to the season of Game of Thrones that everybody else is on. We haven't watched the first episode because we're saving it. So we're going to binge one through, what is it, five? By the five that's currently out and six is coming out this Sunday. Pretty much the whole season Which in one day. Which is easy because it's so short. Like it's so, the last it's, season is so short. Especially if we start off in the start of the day. Like we'll be caught up with everybody yeah. else in real time. Because the very last episode is coming out this, this Sunday. Yeah, and and I'm like so sad about it. This is the first show you're actually going to finish in its entirety, huh? You guys know that we were watching like the originals of Empire Diaries and all that. I'm watching it for the first time, both shows. And she already watched both shows. But she kept the last season of both shows unwatched. And I'd right? like to think that it was God's like will. What do you mean? Because he knew that I was gonna watch it with you so we can watch the last season together. Because for some reason I like finished all the shows up until the last season. It's so weird. Like why didn't I finish it? I think that's a very big 
thing to like finish that like it, it, might sound, it might sound really dramatic but it's because you were watching that before you got with me right like when you were like young and i was watching it consistently like it's not like i really binged it like mm -hmm. i grew up with the show like i like, watched like, the very the premiere the first episode in like my old 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 like, like you're watching house. it in like real like time like yeah every week every week i feel like that's a bigger deal because that's like a part of your childhood it sounds so deep and it doesn't have to be but i know it, it is deep because like, like once you once you finish the show it's like you're finishing your childhood it's though. like the world is over for me i don't know it's so weird mm -hmm. i remember when uh when i thought spongebob was gonna end that was really hard for me i'm gonna be honest with you that was really hard or like when i stopped watching the fairly odd parents and i tried to watch it again and all of a sudden my f has a dog and a baby and a bunch of other stuff i like never a watched sister that. Uh, well you didn't watch nickelodeon oh my god everybody's gonna come for my yeah. throat Alyssa didn't watch nickelodeon Ain't i don't know something? why i don't know if i just didn't have the channel you watch disney channel right yeah if you had disney you had access to nickelodeon right one's not better than the other i don't know why i wouldn't they're watch just it. different i feel like nickelodeon pushed the envelope a bit more in terms of jokes yeah they did. right because disney was very like and sparkly and like where a kid could be a kid type of thing they have the chuck e cheese slogan actually they'd say the word boob like more f***ed up kids watch nickelodeon more than disney at least back then the shows back then were so much better than the shows now on nickelodeon on both mm -hmm. i'd be honest if they had like the shows from like when we were kids still airing with like some new episodes if they were still airing those shows but the characters were just like adults they'd have to change the episodes so much instead of like oh it's f***ing miley's first boyfriend it's like oh it's miley's first like sonogram oh miley gets a pap smear you know <laughs> We were young when Hannah Montana and like Sweet Love of Zack and Cody Cast were there. And you know how there's like Ashley Tisdale and Miley Cyrus? They were like our age yeah. during that time that they were filming the show, but yeah. we were younger. I can't imagine them being that age on a Disney show. It brought them a lot of opportunities, which is great, but I feel like there was so much they had to censor. Oh, yeah. Because it's Disney. Because we know how we are at that age. Yeah, so right? it's like that's the age where you're like starting to be experimental and stuff like that, but yeah. it's like you're in the limelight of like Disney. Maybe that's why they go crazy sometimes. Yeah, but like I've heard stories of them like doing like drugs and stuff you know like they were 16 any guy from the age of 12 to 85 will grab their d once a day so i could only imagine being on a disney show and thinking man i really want to grab my d today let's say it's alternate universe right mm -hmm. but you're this huge freaking criminal went to jail and now you have a death sentence right there's a thing called your last meal they where they give you oh like, my the god last meal you want. what would you want to be on that meal the seafood boil oh, no but you can pick multiple things though. like that yeah yeah you can i've never done it obviously i'm still alive but i know you can pick like multiple food okay my top i'd be like a seafood boil from boiling crab i want king crab legs shrimp the whole shebang sauce medium with a bunch of lemon potatoes and two corns wings on the side you want to know something crazy what because i read up on these like famous last meal things uh -huh. of like the most famous criminals out there this one dude who was so psycho i forgot what he did he did something crazy obviously he's not here because he had the death sentence right he asked i forgot what kind it was but some sort of seed like an olive seed like a mango seed or like an orange seed something right in his head he was just like i'm gonna eat this seed so that way when they kill me and bury me i'm gonna grow a tree like he thought he was gonna come back or his body no, would just he thought he thought tree. he would be able to like sprout a tree his thought process is like well they're gonna put me underground that's where like dirt and soil is let me eat this seed so i can become a tree gotta give him props though he was trying to like save the earth but like isn't that insane your last meal you choose a, a, a seed that probably wasn't it there's probably other stuff that was it that was really it. This dude was deranged. Maybe he was an environmentalist. What do I like? My I don't think I don't think I could have that if I was on the death row, uh, sentence though. No, but they have. Uh, I forgot. It was like conjugal conjugal. It's, it starts with a C, I think. But like for prisoners in certain jails, they'll have those visits with their like wives, where they're allowed to like consummate. Yeah. Love that. I ever tell you about the time I wanted to be a cop? Yeah, you would have been a hot cop. I feel like I would have been a lazy cop though. Yeah. <laughs> you go 95. Me too. <laughs> I'm a smart ass, right? So I'm gonna think of like if I were to pull somebody over for doing like 105, right? To catch them, I would have had to have been doing 105 too. <laughs> Why don't I get a ticket, right? You know, you have the clock? think about that. No, I'm raising my hand to oh, speak. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Do you have the cop that um put himself on? Yeah. What? No, he gave himself a ticket because he was speeding on the job. You know what? That's honorable, but like you're that's down. so honorable. I love that. We you're love down. an honest um, man. I'm just about to stop. Oh yeah. Bye. All right, thanks for watching. All right, we might as well close the video. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Love you guys. I hope everybody's going to have a good week. Don't let anybody bring you down. I love you.
click that notification button to get notified every single time we upload comment down below what you want to see next and if you're still here comment what your last meal would be if you were on the death sentence anything else thanks for staying till the end this long thanks for staying you want to see mine yeah i have to hurry i have to hurry the camera's gonna die yeah you have to hurry go now <laughs> okay you don't have to do it twice we, we, we don't have to do it twice. <laughs> Cause you thought I was gonna do the thing, but I, 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 know, I did but this you don't instead, have to, you don't and it's funny. It's fine.